Jesus Christ! Are you out of your fucking mind? Fuck, 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 fuck! Hey, would you get on the right fucking side of the road? I'm trying! Certain elements in Washington are pushing for a military intervention into Mexico and much of the public is behind them on this. But the Mexican government claims that such an action would be tantamount to a declaration of war. So the president is between a rock and a hard place here. He doesn't want war with Mexico. But then again, seven federal agents are dead, and that simply can't stand. That's why this should be an FBI investigation. The DEA has compromised itself enough already. FBI? We've been investigating the Mendoza cartel for over a year oh, now. Oh, yeah, that's worked out well. Enough! This interagency bullshit has got to stop. That's why I brought in Assistant Deputy Director Shane Dixon. She created this task force and she'll be running it. Miss Dixon? Agent Stone was investigating the sale of military weaponry to the Mendoza cartel in Juarez. Why the hell wouldn't you tell us that? Water under the bridge, Agent Guerra. The Mendozas are a new player in Juarez. Not much is known about their leader, Juan Mendoza, but the scope of their operation is growing exponentially. Drugs, guns, gambling, prostitution. We've never seen a new cartel grab power so quickly. Which is why we think they may have infiltrated one or more of our federal law enforcement agency. That bombing was no accident. They knew exactly where and when to strike. And that's why neither the DEA nor the FBI are running this operation. We have a totally autonomous team. Miss Dix and I have another meeting to get to. From this moment on, it's all up to you. Don't fuck it up. Let me introduce everyone. Special Agent Eddie Guerra joined the DEA soon after completing his tour of duty in Operation Desert Storm. He holds the record for the single largest drug seizure in Southern California history. He's also the only DEA agent involved in the investigation who managed to survive the bombing. FBI Special Agent Kimberly Evans, the youngest agent ever to win the FBI Medal for Meritorious Achievement. She single-handedly apprehended a serial killer who had murdered 32 women and in the process saved the life of his last victim. I brought her into the task force because of her ties to Los Angeles criminal gangs connected to the cartel. So you're in charge overall, but who's in charge on the street? Detective Benjamin McCall. He's with LAPD's Robbery Homicide Division. A 30-year veteran, he is a two-time winner of the Medal of Valor. A homicide detective? With all due respect, ma'am, isn't this a little out of his jurisdiction? 
Not at all. Stone's daughter Jessica contacted Detective McCall the day after the bombing and told him her father had been threatened just the day before. Which means we actually have a suspect and a witness. The suspect is Antonio Alvarez. Why'd she take that to the LAPD? Why not come to us? That's why. That's right, Agent Guerra. They all served together in Vietnam. McCall knows them both. So two became cops, and one became a crook. Worse than that, he's an asshole. Agent Evans, Agent Guerra, I'd like you to meet Detective McCall. You'll have whatever you need as far as resources. But in terms of manpower, you're on your own. No backup from federal agencies. We don't know who we can trust, so you'll only report to me. You're going to hit the Mendoza cartel as hard as humanly possible. Find and arrest those responsible for that bombing and protect the witness because without her, we don't have anything. What if we find out the cartel has someone inside the FBI? Or the DEA? Well, then the hardliners will have a reason to send the military into Mexico. And let's pray that's not the case. Because if that happens, a lot of innocent people are going to get hurt. We need to let the public know that any foreign asshat who comes after us in our own country will get lit up like a goddamn Christmas tree. If the tip pays off, you'll get the I'm rest. How have you been? Of course not. Oh, you know how I feel about you, right? Detective McCall? Catch you later, Ben. You bet. What can I do for you, sweetie? My name's Jessica Stone. You knew my father. He died in that DEA bombing. He left a letter with his lawyer. It said if something happened to him, I should find you. That I could trust you. Is this funny to you? Look, I'm sorry, but there's nothing I can do for you. But you were his friend, right? Right. A long, long time ago. It's just that someone came to our house the day before he died and threatened him. You should be telling this to the DEA, okay? This is way above my pay grade. He said his name was Tony. Who did? The guy who threatened my father. I'm afraid, okay? The way he looked at me was... You know you can't smoke in here, McCall. Let's go out to my car. But, but can't we just... Now! Stan, it's McCall. Listen, I need to get in touch with somebody in charge at the AGO. Yeah. I think I have a witness in the bombing case. Goodbye to him. Please. We can't take the risk, Mija. It's too dangerous. What do you remember from your father's conversation with Alvarez? They were arguing. I, he was yelling about some $50 million deal. As soon as they saw me, they went silent. And then Alvarez started threatening him. Was he intimidating or bribing him? Either or. Gold or lead. Oro o la chingada. What case was Stone working on exactly? The cartel is buying military-grade weaponry. Grenade launchers, anti-tank rockets, night vision goggles. Stone was trying to find their supplier. For 50 mil, they can buy a fucking Abrams tank. Alvarez is probably the middleman. So you have no idea who the supplier is? Nope. Then the deal's probably already done, darling. Maybe not. Aranya recently flooded the city with a shitload of new product, eh? Aranya? They moving out of East L.A.? Up and out, chica. They distribute for the cartel. Maybe Mendoza's trying to make a little extra cash for that big weapons buy. 
I hear they're even selling their shit to the rolling 50s. Well, if that's true, then maybe what we need to do is throw a wrench into the operation and fuck things up. If the major players get pissed enough, they might show themselves. <laughs> Hell, we might even find the pendejo who planted that goddamn bomb. You okay, Jess? Please, just let me say goodbye to him. Stone was in the LAPD before he joined the Bureau. He had a lot of friends. I want to be Enough. there. Enough! What, where are you taking me? Somewhere safe. Are, are you staying with me? You'll have protection. We need to go poke a stick in a spider's nest. And I think I know just how. Do tell. The enemy of my enemy is my carnal. Do you think this interagency task force has the resources to make a difference? Absolutely. The president is determined to stop the spread of drug-related violence. The Mexican government has promised full cooperation. Rebecca Cuellar, LA Times. Do you believe this investigation could be the precursor to a U.S. military incursion into Mexico? At this point, we're not ruling out anything. The president has given me full authority to do whatever is necessary to bring to justice those who would threaten our way of life. From the streets of Los Angeles to the mountains of New Mexico to the Rio Grande, we will hunt these evildoers down. We will seize their drugs, freeze their assets, destroy their arsenals, and hang them high like the outlaws they are. This is war. We have declared war on the Mendoza cartel. Weapons are in the trunk. Take what you want and get in the car. A beautiful day for a drive, huh? Weapons loaded. Ready to go. Then get in the car. I gotta get out of the city more often, man. Look at these mountains. You ever see so many trees? The perfect place to hide a marijuana plantation, Sequoia National Park. How come you DEA boys didn't tell the Bureau about this? Afraid to share the glory? I'm nah, afraid you'd screw it up. And your boss isn't going to be pissed when we burn his case? They won't be blaming us for burning this shit down. Nah, they'll be blaming Aranya. At least that's the plan. So we torch the Vato Locos pot fields and leave some tags that point to Aranya. You really believe the Vatos will go after Aranya? If someone burned up a couple of million that belonged to you, wouldn't you want some payback? They'll buy it. All right, easy, easy. We're close now. It's here, on the right. You sure you know the way? Look, I saw the satellite photos, man. This is the way to the first field. All right, looks like we have our way in. Here. Here? We're gonna have to leave the car and walk the rest of the way. There they are. Guess my CIs don't suck after all. Can we do this without firing any shots? Hey! Who the fuck? Chino, wake up! Let's waste those Where? pendejos! Oh, 
out the bien way! Bring it on, bitch! Oh, keep your head down! I guess that's all of them. What do we do with them? Leave them. They're not going anywhere. Uh, is it far? To the top. We should be able to see the first field from this hill. Mmm. We got a little bit of a hike. You sure you can make it, Detective? Yo, Evans, you might have to carry his ass. Let's go, jackass. Look at this. A fucking ocean of weed in a goddamn national forest. Holy shit. I told you. That's a lot of damn weed. Think we can burn it all? We just need to burn enough to piss those vatos off. See those tents? Seems like that's where they store what they've already harvested. If we torch two of them, you'll be able to see that smoke for miles. The fire lookout at Bald Mountain will call in the smoke jumpers. The Forest Service will take care of the rest. Let's go! Shoot him! Oh, ah. Ahead! Oh. Yeah, now, you know, you don't have to do this all by yourself. Oh, Get down! That's it. Come on out, bitch. Nice shot, Holmes. McCall, cover me! Hijo de puta! Shooting fish in a barrel, Holmes. Let's torch these tents. Gera, don't fucking inhale it. Uh, he's already baked. Jesus. Let's just spray the tags and get the hell out of here.
Aranya was here, bitches. Let's get back to the car before somebody sees us. Where is that second field? Not far. We take that out and whatever else we can find. Maybe they have a helipad. I would if I was them. Easy in, easy out. Where the hell are we going? Over by the river. It's not far. From there, we have another little hike into the woods. These bitches are done. Time to fuck these assholes up! Try aiming! I will make mine arrows drunk with blood, and my sword shall devour flesh. And I will bathe in the blood of my motherfucking enemies. Ahead! Find some cover! Don't fuck with you, check it! You see anybody moving? I think the bear's gonna be chilling a little early this year. Yeah, let's get out of here before they get the munchies. Quick! Get in! Come on! We aren't surprising these Bartos. I'm guessing they heard the gunfire. Yeah, unless they're deaf. You hear that? Looks like they know we're here. Should we head into the woods? Stick to the plan. There they are! You sure that's them? Who the hell else would be driving like that? Just keep moving! Behind! Take him out! God damn it, they're shooting at me! As we can go with the car. From here, we'll have to hike to the riverbank. Can you hear that? They're looking for us. Move, move! Get under the bridge! Can you see it? No. We have to hike down to the riverbank. Fantastic. We got company! Ahead! Help! Shit, do you ever practice with that piece? Watch out! Grenade!
watching your back, you'd be motherfucking here. dead. Fuck these assholes up! Everybody charged up! Ahead! Shoot, goddammit! Damn, they said we wasted them all. Quiet now. We're getting close. And? I don't know, Holmes. He don't answer. Call again. Who are these fuckers? We'll find out soon enough. Who'd have the up to come after us? See if the road is clear. Oh, fuck. Here they come. She got money. Kill him, eh? Ahead. Hey, you don't miss too much, eh? Shoot, goddammit! Oh, ah, fuck! Shit, God. Now, I think that was the last one. miss too much, eh? Time to take these motherfuckers out. Let's waste those pendejos.
All right, check it. Time to go. Ahead! Shit, do you ever practice with that piece? Simone say they watching out the bien way. Watch out! Grenade! Shit down. Ready. Fine, spray those tags. Take it, let's go. McCall. Detective, it's about Agent Guerra. I'm listening. DEA Internal Affairs is investigating him. What a surprise. He's suspected of pocketing drugs that have been seized in bus and putting the product back out on the street. Apparently, he has a gambling problem. So? So, we also believe he may have some connection to the bombing of that DEA building. But no proof. That's right. We need hard evidence. So keep an eye on him. Just know he can't be trusted. You'll be hearing from Agent Baresi of DEA Internal Affairs. You learn anything, you let him know. Ahead! These motherfuckers are going nice down! Nice shot, Holmes. Show yourself, Now, I think that was the last one. This is not a good day to fuck with me. We wasted them all. Over there. 
I did not come to bring peace, but a motherfucking sword. Ahead! I think they're all fucking dead. We got company! What now? Jesus Christ! Right. Let's hit him! You see anybody else, man? You see that? Shit, someone's up ahead. That's one way to make an entrance. You ain't leaving here alive, fool! You ain't leaving here alive! Say oh. it, If we were watching your back, you. you'd be motherfucking dead. Watch out! Ahead! Got that bitch! Where the hell are you, Evans? Get down! Didn't think they'd ever stop fucking coming. Shit, do you ever practice with that piece? These pendejos are starting to piss me off. Ahead! I think they're all fucking dead.
There's the house. Keep it down. Careful. Ahead! enemies. Shoot! Take them down! You're dead, you hear me? Dead! I'm thinking there's some Vatos behind this door. You ready to surprise their ass? We enter on my go. You know, you don't have to do this all by yourself. Here it comes! What the fuck was that? This is not good. Chopper! Grab some cover! There's gotta be a goddamn armory around here somewhere. Look for something we can use to shoot that son of a bitch down. Watch out! Holy fuck, man! before the cops show up. Come on! Aranya pissed a lot of vatos off today, huh? So you're sure they'll blame this on Aranya? Hell yeah. These boys aren't rocket scientists. Once they see that spider, there'll be some payback. Now we need to piss off one of Aranya's partners in crime. Someone they deal with on a daily basis. Ooh, he's talking about your family, Agent Evans. Look, those assholes are not my family. The rolling 50s deal drugs for Aranya. Isn't that your baby brother's crew? He won't tell us anything. 
He doesn't want anything to do with me. What a surprise. There must be something you can tell us about their operation. I mean, hell, didn't you grow up there? Well, there is a stash house they deal out of, or at least they used to. Orale, that's perfect. I mean, what if Aranya were to rip them off, huh? Take back the drugs they already sold them? That would piss them off pretty bad, right? I just... What? I don't want Dion to get hurt. We can watch out for baby bro. No problem. 